Hello everybody and welcome to Diary of Our Days at the Breakwater. I think I got the title right. Uh, it, they they pulled the title out of their bum, basically. Uh, episode review, anime, re episode one review. That was easy to say. Uh, so yeah, this show, from what I've seen, which is the first episode and a few trailers, it, I, I'm assuming how it's going to go is we're going to learn how to do a different sort of fishing every week. Maybe. That's just, that's how I see it going. Because you got like the multi rod this week. We'll have like net net fishing. I, 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 I'm going to be completely honest with you people. I uh, don't know a lot about fishing, to be completely honest. So I guess this will be a learning experience for all of us. Maybe not all of us. Probably just me. But it'll be fun. It's, it, cute girls can make anything enjoyable. And fishing is certainly no different. Anyway. Let's jump into the episode, see how it all went down and everything. Let's do this. We open up with seeing our main character, she's called Hina, she's doing some sewing. Basically, she likes doing things indoors, which, that's perfectly reasonable. Especially, at least, at least trying times she's having a, she's got the right idea, stay indoors. Uh, but yeah, she's just moved to a new town, she goes around looking at the town. It's a very nice town, there's fishes, there's a bunch of good stuff happening, it's a very nice town. Uh, then she sees a bug, and is like, okay, it's not nice anymore. Bugs are scary, don't you know? Uh, she spots someone in the distance after dealing with this bug. Thinks they're passing out, heat stroke, you know, dangerous stuff. Turns out, no, she was just sorting out, like, untangling a, a wire, like a fishing line. Uh, Hina, knowing how to do, deal with untangling, is like, I'll help you out, bro. Not bro, it's a girl. Her name is Kuroiwa. She's a senpai at the same school that, uh, that Hina's transferred to. Um, yeah, she, as thanks for untangling the, the, the wire, the line, I should say, not a wire, um, she says, hey, you want to give it a go? And Hina gives it a go. She fishes, uh, and eventually, after a little bit, we learn its patience is key. They step to the right a lot, uh, which is obviously a very important step. I think you'll find it in all the fish diaries. Fish diaries? We'll go with that. Uh, but no, she eventually does fish something out of the water. It's an octopus, and... As you would expect, octopuses, she's not, it's scary. Octopus lands on her and she does not take it out well. She's like, this is weird, please remove it. It, it crawls up her tentacles, you know, not, I'm just gonna, the joke makes itself, I'm not gonna stoop that low, but you know the joke. Uh, then Kuroiwa uses this opportunity, essentially blackmailing her. It's like, if you want me to remove the octopus, you will join my club. Hina has to agree because damn she's not touching that octopus i understand it. i wouldn't want an octopus touching me either like animals are creep when i was a kid especially man animals didn't even like them didn't even like like disneyland like the mascot costumes didn't even like them that's so zoo zoos like petting zoos were a no-go as well animals one time a giraffe spat on me and a camel licked my ear so you know i have bad experiences with animals i guess you could say maybe animals just don't like me who knows? Don't want to encounter no octopuses, basically. But, uh, yeah, then Hina passes out after, uh, a bit. After a bit. Or is that... No, no, she doesn't. That's after this. She kills the octopus in front of her, pulls its face off, and that makes Hina pass out. She wakes up in the Breakwater Club, uh, which is what she's joined, and then she sees the octopus gutted and passes out again. So, Hina, you... I'm imagining that was happening a lot. A lot of Hina passing out at some... Some gross things, because that, that makes a lot of sense. To the school opening ceremony we go. It's pretty standard for an opening ceremony. Hina uh, really doesn't want to go to the Great Water Club. She wants to go to the, the Crafts Club instead. So she's like, right, I'll go apologize and I'll go, you know, I'll go, I'll leave the club and I'll go, go have a great time in the Crafts Club and good stuff. Uh, and then to, to like cure her nerves, she like stabs a dog a little bit. A, a fake dog, like a, a felt dog. But it's still a dog she's stabbing, uh, you know? Makes that makes her nerves better, so I will go with that. Uh, she sees another girl. Other girl jump hugs her. She knew Hina, apparently, back in the day. She's called Natsumi. Uh, she looks different. She's not as tanned as she used to be. That's why Hina didn't recognize her. Uh, also, another girl rocks up. She's called Ono. She's big. And that's all I'm going to say. Uh, Kuroiwa is Natsumi's sister, but not actually. Like... Natsumi calls her a sister, but she's not actually, they're just close friends, I guess. Uh, they do group introductions, and the more this longest goes on, the harder it becomes for Hina to say, hey, I want to leave. Because they're like, man, you saved the club, and it's like, oh, you know. 
But she does eventually just blurt it out, and Kuroi was like, okay, why don't you try fishing just once, and then we'll leave you alone. And, I mean, we all saw where this was going, didn't we? We were like, she's going to enjoy it, and she's going to want to stick around. Uh, and that's... I'm not going to say that's what happened. But, the gang heads to go fishing. Hina just wants to get this over with, so she can go home and stab more felt dogs, I guess. Uh, there's Chum in a box. Chum is pretty grim. Uh... They ca what they're catching today? Horse mackerel. They're like little fishies. Again, don't know a lot about fish or fishing in general. So this is a brand new, a whole new world. Don't want to get sued by Disney, so I won't sing it in tune. But you get what I was going for. Uh, this fishing rod they've got has got multiple hooks. And it releases chum from the top of it to get a bunch of things coming at once. It was very, it was honestly, if, if we learn about different fishing rods every week, I'd consider that a win. Because... That was cool. Didn't even know they were a thing. I literally only thought there was the base fishing rod. I guess there was with a reel and without a reel. That was my that's my fishing knowledge right there. Uh, she actually does manage to catch a catch one. She even holds it. Uh, it's just flopping around. I know it's not it's just gasping for air or water air. You know what I'm trying to say because it can't breathe. Which you know, poor fish is all I'm going to say to that. Uh, but then they use the multiple hooks, which means they can catch more, more, more at once. So I guess then they have a little competition about it. Uh, they don't say this, but they're kind of like, oh, I caught four, I caught five, you know? Catch as many fish as they can. Good stuff. They eat some fried fish. Immediately, the other one was, uh, what was her name? The big one, oh no, was cooking some fish. So that was good. Then they have some, and it tastes good. And then, of course, Hina is like, you know what? I will stick around for a bit. This will be good. She goes to clean out the chum bucket. Not that one. There's no plankton in this chum bucket. And there's a lot of insects in there. And she's like, nope, this was a mistake. I'm out. And then that was where the episode ended. She didn't actually... The, the nope, I'm out was sort of like... She shouted it to the air. Like, she's like, ah. And the episode ended. So she's still in. But she's... I, 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 I quite enjoyed this, you know. That was the end of the episode. Um, uh, I'm not expecting this to be the greatest show ever. But for what it is, so far... It was fine, you know? Fishing. I, I'm down to learn about fishing. As I said, they can make cute girls, cute anime girls can literally sell anything. And that is, that is an achievement in itself. But hopefully, and hopefully, uh, but if by the end of this I want to go fishing, that is a success. Um, anyway, thank you everybody for watching this review. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, check out other reviews and stuff I've got as well. And subscribe for more. This show will be every week, of course. Uh, I will see you next week for another episode of this show. See you then, and bye guys.